Hello crafty friends, it's Alicia of the Call Me Crafty Owl YouTube channel and in today's video I'm back from my little holiday break and I'm ready to share some happy mail I got in December as well as some cards for the show us your sheet load feature. I hope you'll stick around and see what everybody sent in. Thank you so much for stopping by today. If this is your first time to my channel, I hope by the end of this video that you'll be inspired to click on that subscribe button below and maybe even tap on that bell for notifications. If you're already a subscriber and regular viewer, welcome back. I'm so glad that you're here. At the end of each month, I've been doing a show us your sheet load video where I feature cards that subscribers have sent in to me using any of the sheet load of cards printables. Well, this month I did get one package that said, this isn't a sheet load of cards, I just wanted to send this to you. So what I thought I would do is if anybody sends me a card during the month that isn't a show us your sheet load card, I will just do one feature at the end of the month and share it all. I hope all of you have had a great holiday season so far. I definitely have enjoyed my little break. I have spent it just with my husband and my daughter here at home celebrating Christmas. And then um, the past few days, we decided to make a surprise trip to see my mom in Iowa. And we also got to see my sister and her family. So that was awesome. She loved the surprise and we enjoyed getting back to see them. I was pretty spoiled for the holidays here. If you are interested in seeing any of either the crafty items I got, and I even got some non-crafty items, let me know below and maybe I can share those with you. I'm excited to start using the stuff over the next month or so. One gift that I have already used and I'm kind of excited to feature in a video today is my new gel nail starter kit. I love to have polished nails, but I find that whenever I polish them with regular polish, they just chip off, you know, after five minutes and then they look bad for weeks because I don't take the polish off. But I also don't want to go pay every couple weeks to have my nails done. So I saw some reviews and some videos here on YouTube about the Gelin nail polish kit. I am not connected with them in any way, but I will tell you that for me who is not good at polishing nails, this was my first time and I love the way they look. I did this on December 26th. I have washed dishes, I have done other stuff since then that use my nails and they still are so nice and shiny. So I will link the kit below if you wanna go check it out on Amazon if you're interested in trying it out for yourself. It is very fun. But let's go ahead and get back to the point of this video opening some happy mail here. I'll go ahead and leave this one, which I know for sure is not a sheet load of cards until the end. Um, but until then, we'll go ahead and we'll open up the packages that I think are viewer cards. So I mentioned before that while I was back in Iowa, I did see my sister and her family and she hand delivered me a card to share here for the end of the month review. So here is her December sheet load card. She used a cut apart card for that top and then stamped the dear friend. Her name is Crafty Days here on YouTube. Next we have a card from Paula. I don't know if you can see it on camera but there's some gold foiling here and down on the tree. So adorable. Love that stitched die cut scalloped rectangle. I will read the inside later, Paula. Thank you for sending this. <laughs> I did just quickly look at the back and she um, has, below her signature, has put avid sheet load fan. Thank you, Paula. The next one is from Kim. Kim has used the October 2019 sheet load of cards printable to create this fun fold card. She is Metal Scrap and Chick here on YouTube. I hope you'll go check her out. So cute, I love the gems on there. Thank you, Kim. These cards are all from Jacqueline and she has sent in three cards and she has labeled each one here with which sheet load that she created. And this one she said she has modified the design. So this is the same 
sheet load that Kim used. So let's see here. Oh, that is very fun. So she kind of has, this part is the same, except she has used this fun shape, which I love. And I love that cute little image. And then she's made this other flap to kind of hold it close. And I was thinking, what does RWF mean? Well, ta-da, resting witch face. This is so stinking adorable. I love it. Here is the November 2019. Oh, this is just gorgeous, guys. I wish you could see this in person. Lots of deep texture on the background. And for this one, she rotated the image. You'll notice if you go back to the November 2019 layout, it's different than this. These pieces usually actually go across here horizontally. Love the little addition of that. That is just beautiful, Jacqueline. And the inside has some more of that pretty gold paper. And then finally, she used the December 2019 sheet load of cards. This one again has some shine that you probably can't see on camera. This white tag here is kind of like a pearlescent. And then I love the little blue gems. Oh, and on the inside, even some more of that paper from the front. Love those, Jacqueline. Thank you so much for sharing those. Now we will open the one from Kathy that she said was just something for me. Thank you, Kathy, for the beautiful card in the note. She has sent me some, I believe they are hand painted by her, wooden Christmas tree ornaments. These are so beautiful, Kathy. Thank you so much. We won't have the tree up much longer, but I will definitely get these put on there. If you want to find out how you can share any sheet load of card cards that you make with me to share here at the end of the month, I will link the show us your sheet load video in the description box below. And all of my videos always have my PO box in the description box if you just wanna send me a little hello. So in the new year, I do plan on having some crafty goals, but one of those goals is to definitely that I wanna start sending some cards out to my subscribers. So I will definitely be starting with those people who are sending me their cards to share with me. And I'm going to try to participate in Amalia's collaboration here on YouTube. I will link her video below describing kind of the overview of it and how you can join if you want to go check it out and have some goals for yourself. If you enjoyed this video, I hope you'll give it a thumbs up. Until my next video, which will be the new sheet load of cards for January 2020, I hope you're all having a crafty day. Bye-bye.